Alright everyone, hello and welcome to my live reaction to Princess Mononoke. Mononoke, yeah. <laughs> Studio Ghibli. Ah, this is going to be one of the classics I've never seen. I've wanted to get to all these. And thank you to the person who recommended me this via Twitter. I forgot your name, I'm sorry, but... Let me know if you're in the comments, I'll give you a shout out somehow, I guess. I don't know. Uh, I'm watching sub, so I'm going to have to watch very quick. And I think I'm going to do this in three parts, 45 minute increments, so that I can take a uh, intermission break in between. You know, rest my eyes for five minutes, whatever the case. I missed that intro text, so I'll just really focus. There's some sort of beast in the forest. What the heck? What on earth is that? Got aliens or something? I uh, read the description a while ago. Studio Ghibli, it's gotta be pretty good. All right, we got, we got somebody riding a creature. I think that kind of trench travel is very interesting. So there's some sort of threat going on. <clears throat> Good luck to me with the names, I'm sorry. And I generally like the shows more than movies, but I, I, I'll still deal with the movies, you know, nothing against them. The movies can be fine and hunky dory. Oh yeah, something's coming. What the heck is that? Yeah, what on earth is it? It's like a gobbledygook. What is it? Yeah. I... I'm gonna also have to watch the time frame so I don't go over. What the heck? What on earth is this? Some sort of gobbledygook. Oh, it, it's some sort of creature or entity. Yeah, what the heck? It's got like eyes and legs and it causes a demon god. What? Good grief. It's like a boar with all sorts of gobbledygook. Or is the gobbledygook possessing the boar? The wild, the giant wild boar. I don't know what animal that technically is. Some sort of eye bell or something or I forget what they're called this thing's going after everything okay who's supposed to stand against this I like that this is like old style Japan though Not animation, I mean setting. I think that's pretty neat. Seems to be, anyhow. This is reminding me of... That kind of thing is reminding me of... Uh, well, kind of spoilers, but something of ReZero. Zero. 
Oh. Yeah, it just targets life, I guess. See what happens if you shoot an arrow at it. Ah, great. That stuff's not gonna... Oh, man. Right to the eye. This stuff, what the heck? Oh. Goodness. Won't it just possess something else if it kills the giant wild boar? That's interesting. I love the old style Japan theme. Oh. So he is cursed though. So it's going to return. Good grief. So that's what a totally cursed creature from that stuff was like. Okay, it just, you know, took it all out. Wow. I think oracles were all sorts of odd information and beliefs type thing. Don't know the uh, real description. Hmm. So he's a shiitaka. Oh man, that's not good. That is not good. That is a, a part of the curse of it. Oh. Man, he was brave. Honorable. So west direction of where it supposedly came from.
yeah, Shogun was like the the leader of all the tribes, or the ruler of all the tribes. Cut his hair. Digging the sound, the soundtracks. All right, we're over 10 in. Jeez, we got a long way to go. This is going to be tough on my eyes. So yeah, parts two and three, ignore the timer because it's start. I just I just have it start at zero. So uh, when that time arrives, so he's traveling forth away from his village to a whole different tribe, probably or clan. The various landscapes. Oh, Japan. What is that thing? It's like a, I forget what they're called. Wonder if that river's cold or warm. Hmm. So he's arrived at another tribe or clan. Oh boy. Looks like a lot of military stuff going on. Oh. Oh. Oh gosh, it's an invasion. Good grief, that would be bad to get hit. Oh my goodness. Whoa. The curse affected him. He took his gosh darn hands off, his arms off. Whoa. The curse has amplified him, so it's like a it's like a two sided coin. The so the, the the curse on his arm has amplified him. I don't think all that stuff is gonna do anything, but naturally you would Oh, it's growing. So he's on limited time. With how much this is going to burn my eyes out, I'm really hoping there's not a tearjerker moment. That might be bad. I love the architecture of old style Japan. Well, still into modern, I guess. But the uh, roofings and stuff.
Yeah, he mentioned samurai. That's the uh that's the thing if you're in a new land or area they can try and deceive you. Why is there a thing on the screen? That's gonna be distracting. I wonder what year this takes place. It seems to be real old style classic Japan. A long time ago. <clears throat> it's gotta be at least 500 years ago. Maybe a thousand, maybe more. Hmm. So he's got a kind of an ally in a whole different area. Elk, elk, elk. Maybe that's what it is. He said it reminded of folks like that. Who wrote on them? <laughs> what are with those shoes? It's very interesting. The Deer God. Giants. The past. Interesting. But he said, where no man can tread. I wonder why. Usually mankind wipes out <clears throat> whatever is the most threatening wild animals around so massive creatures would explain why nobody's near that area rain oh the sound of rain This is pretty good detail for back then, my gosh. Oh man, I hate cliff sides. I can't, I can't stand that. What the heck? They could see wolves that far in the rain, my gosh. They gotta protect their livestock. Oh, those are the the fire weapons, right? Firecrackers are fire weapons. Or is it gunfire? Might be gunfire. Yeah, I think it's gunpowder based weapon. I thought it was possible flamethrower. So this is more further back. What the heck is on the one wolf leading them? What's on the one wolf? Oh boy. Man, that would be tense. Oh jeez. Moro. Oh my gosh, that thing is huge.
This thing's a monster. Ah, uh, they did use flame. Hmm. Crazy. What a mess. A normal sized wolf would be terrifying enough, let alone a car sized wolf. Holy heck, that just ruin your drawers. Oh. This is a good movie so far. I really like the old style setting. He's just busy saving everyone. He's gonna look for more. Oh. Hey. What the heck? What the? What on earth? Good gosh. Fateful encounter. What on earth? Two tails. Ah, oh, so it was a person on the other one. Oh. Is his leg broke? What is that? Kodama. I was just going to say, don't you move. What on earth? That is disturbing. Oh. What the heck? So they're like forest spirits or something. What on earth? That is like disturbing chatter. They are naked. They're leading the way, though. Leading the way. Oh, man, that would have stunk if my audio was botched. Thank goodness it wasn't this time. It was on something else I was working on. He's really helpful of others, to others. A tree as a mother to forest spirits of sorts? That's all I can think of them to be. Swampy swamp.
just the nature and wilderness of old Japan. I want to read about old Japan now. Ah. Oh. He's on their turf. The other world. Look at how peaceful it is, the nature. Uh oh. Different ones. What has three toes? Alligator? It's a swamp. Alligator. Alligator. Going with alligator. What do you guess? Gotta be alligator. Which means there's a threat. There's a huge alligator in there somewhere. Oh, man. A normal size alligator or crocodile is enough. What does he see? Oh, looks like wild deer. He's got good eyes. I wish I had his eyes. Whoa. Good gosh, get that one for your... What the heck is... That is really weird. Oh no, it's going to take him over eventually. Somehow that was sensing it. Oh, plus that's going to be a destructive force and he's going into like one of the most peaceful remote regions. But the curse is going to take him over. He's probably young too, he's probably only like 14. So I got a bug on mine, I got like a loading circle that's going non-stop kind of on mine, very annoying. I'll see if I can fix that in between the next part. <clears throat> That's just going to drive me crazy. Mm. Well, that's an entire fortress, and they've got metalworking going on. Looks like trade. Lots of defenses, lots of resource management. Oh, yeah, this is pretty advanced very good defensive location beside body of water and uh, mountains we're friendly we're friendly worried it was the other. It's significant that they made it through. Nani? <laughs> I gotta get in one of those. Hey, that was a horse noise. We'll let it go. Rifleman. 
discredit me. Discrediting him. So they've made it through before, but just it was half the time, so very significant. I'll leave it to a girl to be trashing the guy that hurt his leg. Getting after the guys. So he did show himself. There was a bit of a back and forth there, some joking, some being serious. Looks like we had 12 minutes yet. The visuals are surprisingly good, especially at certain times. A lot must have went into this, a lot. Digging the new guy. Okay. Jeez. Yeah, normal boars are bad enough. Wait, that was past. That wasn't present, was it? I 
wonder when this takes place because they kind of got the gunpowdery weapons, but they had gunpowder for a long time. But yet they have kind of gun type things. So. so there was the boar, then there was the gun lady. Uh-oh. He's got to hide it all along. What if he got rid of his arm? Would that fix it or is it still? I don't know. spreaded and they had makeup back then That's pretty interesting as well. If if that's true, I suspect they did have some sort that they would put on. So interesting how far makeup goes back. Very interesting to make up for folks aging. Kind of like a counter counter force counterbalance of it. Um, so it's kind of like a false appearance. Yeah, they got a lot of metal working going on. My gosh, it would be hot in there. Holy moly. The heat from all the fires. Using the weight of the chicks. <laughs> all right, we got seven minutes, six and a half or so. Secret. All the visuals are really cool. I like the garden. I liked the bamboo type steps. That was neat. Oh, this must I don't know when this is, takes place now going rogue. He's not going to be able to control it too long.
my goodness. Yeah, that's weird. She, she cares about all those people who are cursed, I guess. And this is a new kind of gun. What on earth? Uh, it's kind of like a nature versus mankind type of element to it. Kind of a fantasy flare. Oh. Oh. She's pretty intense, too. So he was a river away from being able to heal himself? Bonkers. We got two and a half minutes. Then we're going to cut for the next part. Man, I need a break. This is going to be tough to do the next two parts. This is double the length of a normal episode just for one part of this. I might have to hold off. Oh, that's so cool, they sing. Four days straight. Uh, there's some odd kimonos, but what on earth are those creatures? Uh oh. Ah, uh, one minute. We're gonna cut. Uh, she's looking upon the place. It's well fortified, good location. Jeez. Are they gonna act? sensor she's coming I'm on an okay ah we gotta cut it though we gotta stop we went just to uh, we we went quite a bit over uh because of the uh, the timer, because the timer's delayed. Ah, dang it. We went over uh, most of a minute. So, I didn't even catch that. So, we will call it good there. I'll revert back to the 45 minute mark. We went about, we went most of a minute over. Uh, but I will be back with part two. This was really good so far. This was really good so far. I really liked it. I really liked it. So it's just, it's a lot to, 
deal with as a reaction uh, being that lengthy of a time frame so I like to uh, be able to take breaks and all that in between normally episodes of the sort so so be in 45 minutes rather than you know 24 minutes or so is quite a increase in toll um, I don't know if I'm going to deal with the other two, uh, you know, right away or whether I'll wait a day or whatever the case, I don't know. Um, but th this was, this was really good. I like the old style theme of Japan. Um, I like everything so far. The soundtrack's good. The visuals are good. There's, uh, I don't know where it's going to go. The, the, the wolf creature has to die, yet she's not going to let that happen. She's warring against the other chick. So is he going to get healed, or is he not going to get healed? Uh, if, if he don't get healed, who's he going to go after uh, everyone? It would be a totally cursed human going bonkers and rogue. So, very interesting. But if the blood could have cured him, he was a river away from the cure but he didn't know it was the cure because she was like <sighs> it was like sucking the venom of a snake out of someone and then to but it was like the blood of just getting hit with one of the guns or whatever um the gunpowder so it's like it in and then just spit in a boatload of out and then it's just all over that is that was just really disgusting to me oh man but i'm liking this so far i'm really liking this so far princess mononoke part one was good so far zero minutes to 45 minutes um we went a bit over i didn't catch it i knew that would be an issue uh especially for something this this lengthy and once you're you're trying to be engaged to it uh but i also have to kind of watch the time so part two will be back however the timer keep in mind it will say it will start from zero again so and i got tricked because i was looking at it and it's delayed over time so i thought we were still approaching the 45 minute mark or had just gotten to it or whatever the case and then i look over at the time of this after pausing it or whatever or checking it uh hovering over it and it was later on you know so the timer's delayed over time by like one second a minute or something so anyhow a really good part one to princess mononoke um i'll probably pronounce it wrong and <laughs> you know probably not remember the names but this is this was really good of the movie so far this was really good really good setup and build uh, I love the old style Japan I love the old style Japan the Shogun type era and yet they're getting to the firearms point of things as well very interesting I want to read up on a lot of Japan ah ancient Japan all sorts of stuff about Japan that would be fun. It would be really fun to read a book on Japan. Uh, put it on the to-do list. But anyhow, we will do two more parts, as far as I'm aware. Another 45 minute and another 45 minute. So there will be three parts. So next time will be the 45 minute mark to hour and a half, then hour and a half to the end, I guess. So stay tuned for that. But anyhow, let me know what you thought of part one of Princess Mononoke. This is my live reaction. So so we'll do it in three parts. No way could I do it in one part. No way. That's way too long of a reaction. I'd be, I'd be just destroyed. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do a part two after this. Um, I think I'm going to need quite a break. Whew. So anyhow, thank you very much for watching. Stay tuned for more of the Princess Mononoke anime movie from Studio Ghibli.
think it said 1997. Very impressive. Very impressive. Very good stuff. So, and do keep in mind, <clears throat> I got tables down below, including a playlist of all my movie reactions and a link to donate for those women. So, oh man, I do want to see part two and three though. I do. It's just, it's a lot. It's a lot to react to in one go, in one setting. So, I, I don't want to overwhelm myself and have to stop in the middle of it, you know. So, it wears on me quite a bit. So, anyhow, let me know what you think. And thank you very much for the recommendation, whoever you were on Twitter. Uh, this is good so far, really good. I was, I'm intending to get to pretty much everything. It's just I don't have the time or the energy or the lack of burnout rather so so yeah it's just a whole combination of things not having enough time not enough time not enough anime so anyhow really good start to princess mononoke and i can't wait to see the next part so i think i've been rambling on long enough so i will see you up ahead thanks for watching take your cool